quizzes. You're an unethical teacher. Goodness gracious, don't give your kids pop quizzes. Anyway, uh, I have been waiting for this. I've also been waiting for this set. It's Vivi versus Dill. I think Vivi won this last time, if I remember Ah, uh, I think that, I do think so, because he, uh, he got third last week, right? Second? Something. Okay. Never mind. But you think uh, Vivi beat Dill last week? Something along those lines. Maybe not. Could be completely wrong. With that said, um, I am excited to see this matchup. I am excited to see the Lucario. Post buff Lucario, might I add. Mm -hmm. And actually, already we've seen those buffs working out for, uh, for Vivi. Uh, mainly the dash attack buff. He's been using mm -hmm. dash attack a lot more. That, the fact that the sweet spot is bigger is just nice. It's a nice quality of life thing. And yeah. it means that there are times where all of a sudden it's like, you made a single mistake, I'm a high, high, high damage Lucario. Yeah. I now have a burst stop, and that reliably kills you. Yeah, and it's, and it's not that the sweet spot is bigger, just is out for a really a longer time. Um, uh, still, I think similar buff happened to F tilt. Uh, down tilt, I think, got a little bit faster. Yeah, I think it's just um, faster. Uh, however, yeah, the, the F tilt buff and the dash attack buff are pretty big. Um, and you know, down tilt now is better for combos. Like, Lucario got some nice buffs going into the last patch. Oh, but will those be enough? Ooh. Gonna be surviving that. That Roto Arm, huge base knockback, not the greatest knockback growth. And yeah. that's why you see people surviving it. And honestly, pretty late for sense. Wow. And listen, if you're if you're not killing PP, we all know what happens. Uh you explode. And right now, um, this is a great position for Lucario to be in. You wanna be have that lead, have 120% on you. Um, however, this might very well be a stock. Ooh. Whoa, that was so smart! Yeah. Didn't mash at all, and definitely Dill was expecting it. That's why she went for that up air. And you know what uh, Vivi did? If you saw on the player cam, Vivi pretended to mash. No way. Yeah. Vivi <gasps> pretended to mash, or at least mashed, and it mashed initially and then stopped. Or maybe, maybe like, did did he make mashing sounds with his mouth? Just the controller clicks <laughs> to really throw off, throw off his opponent. Yeah, but still, honestly, it's paid off in dividends. 78. You're dead. What? No, what? Okay, that just worked. All right. Um, I figured up throw was going to come out, but no. Dill ending up choosing to go for that down throw. Yeah, look at him. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, boy. You know, the thing about Lucario is, like, when he takes the first stock, it's like, oh, my God. Jeez. Oh, missed what? the tech. That's a you missed the tech. Uh, that te that's a weird tech to miss mm. because on one hand you feel like oh there's some oh, speaking of <laughs> yeah yeah uh, I guess somebody like stuck a bunch of glue on that left side of the stage so nobody's staying. getting techs there and it's leading to so many deaths just a workplace hazard where's OSHA yeah <laughs> <laughs> thank you De thank you Devin for laughing at <laughs> you're the only person. <laughs> anyway, Come uh... with me and you'll see a world of OSHA violations. <laughs> um, <laughs> did, we're, 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 we are currently at that point of the night, folks. Um, with that said, um, Vivi's still not in a bad position here. Um, I really have been liking how they've been handling the game thus far. Um, and, you know, you, you can kind of play this slow game versus Rob. Uh, you can take the damage, chill, stay on the side of the stage, and wait. Um, you just can't give Rob the opening, and the, the opening is Z-Drop Manor. Mm. Whoa, did you see that up smash? I can't believe that just completely missed Vivi, and that's really pivotal. Not dying is the name of the game right now. It's like, yes, Dill is very much ahead, but if just like two mistakes. I think that's what it takes, right? Two, one and a half mistakes, and that's that's game. Yeah. Um, and the thing is, Lucario doesn't have the hitboxes to just like kill Rob like a character like Bowser can. But Lucario's faster, so Lucario can cover like more ground, cover more space with Aura Sphere. Scary position. Oh. I clearly went for that. that that's oh, that hit Rob oh. standing. That hit Rob standing. No. Oh. Oh, that was a purposeful missed tech. That was actually really smart from Vivi. And now 160%. Dill trying to get back the ledge. Oh! 112. Things are looking so dire for Dill. But one single opening. Oh! <gasps> Tried to single hit there. That is a combo. Oh, you're dead. That's got to be it. Yeah. That's the I'm second shocked. kill like I'm that. Shock Dill's just not going drop, though, there. But holy moly. Yeah. 
Uh, you almost died several times. Can we can, can we please go back to that aura sphere? Did you happen to get that, Devin? Oh, it's okay. Um, I, I'm pretty positive Rob was standing. Yes. And got hit by a full hop aura sphere. That's how big it was. Yeah, and how big Rob is. Yeah, well, that's that's the, the Twitter meme of the day, so. Yeah. Is, um, is it? I I vaguely, I don't recall, actually. I think it could have been either one. If, if it was, it was in the startup of the jump. I it was not also keep particularly mind, high up. Yeah, also keep in mind that Lucario full hop is... Uh, it was not like a full full hop. Sheesh. It, um, that I, was insane. Yeah. Also, kind of worth a note. This stock was actually really good, and we didn't address it at the time. Oh, that was just beautiful stuff from Dill. Uh, but in the end of that especially, Dill was kind of going for these really safe moves, like down tilt, like dash attack, when maybe she should have been looking for actually killing Blucario. Yeah. And I understand, like, the risk is like, oh, I'm not sure 100% if the kill move can land. Uh, and if, if you mess that up, you, you might get blown up yourself because yeah. it's Lucario. But on the other hand, it's like, if you could have won and you didn't go for the kill move because you weren't mm -hmm. confident, that's like the same as, it, like, that's why you lost then. Yes. It's something that in general players kind of, you know, they, they don't really think about it because psychologically you're like, I hit him, so. Uh-oh. Oh, oh sheesh. And, and I definitely understand, you know, Dill's logic uh, as she went into that. You know, you're trying to get Lucario off stage. It's hard for him to recover the higher the percent that he has. Um, and, you, you know, you put Lucario in a position that you can get there, you can get side B fairly easily as Rob. Um, so I understand that. But definitely, you know, you need to just kill Lucario sometimes. And um, without being able to, to kill Lucario before the, like, 110% mark, Lucario really does become a horrifying, horrifying threat. Yeah, you know, <laughs> like Lucario at these lower percents, not necessarily that scary with the exception of forward smash. What? Mm. Bubba -da -bubba. Out the wrong hitbox of uh, down tilt? Is no, out just outside of the lock percent. Already was get was getting oh. sent out. That's oh. death though. Yeah, that, the thing is Lucario's uh, up B does not have a huge hitbox on it um, for certain parts of it. Frankly, that move is very bizarre. I know at some points it has a huge hitbox, at some points it has like no hitbox at all. Um, but yeah, Dill taking full advantage there. Yeah, I wonder if that's something that she can actually rely on, though, because I do feel like there's so much variety in the angling of the up B that either, you know, VV could choose to go high next time, or there might even be, like, a sweet spot where you can just hit her. Mm -hmm. uh, like, you know, the, in the blind range, like, where Robin's self is spinning around. Ooh, tried to side B that, too, to reflect it, um, but did not come out in time. Rob? Yeah. Um, a slow, and yeah, I mean, even if, if a misinput, um, slow, that, that reflector is one of the slowest in the game, so, um. Yeah, at the same time, it does kind of present this threat where, even though it is slow, it's hard to come out, a lot of the times, Vivi loves to throw out aura from across the stage, just like a chat, because it's a giant thing. You want to shield it and lose half your shield? Uh. But can't really do that against a character with a reflector, even if it is a slower reflector like Rob. Because at the very least, Rob, it is very long-lasting. <laughs> wow. That was so cute! Ooh, try to use uh, Gyro, Gyro for a little shot down. there. <laughs> uh, this is a big stop that Dill has to take. Not enough just yet, though. A nice recovery by Vivi. Yeah, I like the high recoveries, but at the same time, there's a lot of risk to them. Oh, what? Yeah, and the crazy thing is that Lucario gets so many combos out of that Aura Sphere. Can um, get Aura Sphere, Aura Sphere Bear. Yeah, right there. And then, thanks for the timing, Vivi. Very sick. Uh, All right. Immediate response, though. No time to let Vivi rest on laurels. And like that, we have once more a very even game. 0% for both players here. And, man, like, when you're in this situation against Lucario specifically, what what is going through your mind? It's just so hard to know how the shape of the game is going to go. In a roundabout way, you kind of want this because you have all the rage in the world. Oh goodness, that was almost it. That it might be it. No. Okay. Yeah. 
that downer had landed, but yeah. BB did a great job stalling, making sure that Dilly did not really know the timing that she needed to go for. Oh, you died. That's hilarious. That's so funny. You died at 76%. That's, did you notice the spacing around there? Normally, Rob Neutral Air, fantastic move. Fantastic yeah. move. Normally, people are like, oh, but you can parry it. There yeah. was no parry necessary here. Just gorgeous spacing. Also, look at the percentage. Yeah. 79. Uh, yeah, 80%. Ba -ba -oh. So good. Yeah, no, the spacing was really good by me. And that move lunges you back quite a bit. If I could point that out really quickly. Um, that move lunges you back quite a bit. Yeah. Yeah, and you can just I see. Think, I don't think he needed to lunge back, though. Uh, like, here, let's take a look. Frames back with okay. the hitbox. Yeah, the, he yeah, didn't just start. turned around and did yeah. it. Yeah. Did, That's just good reaction. Was, did, hold on a second. Did Dill have time to shield? No, still it still looks like they are in. Yeah, can you see Rob's okay. arms moving still yeah, yeah. from uh, landing line recovery? But that yeah. was probably like frames away. Yeah, I mean that, that was move, like maybe the very next. That move frame. only has like six or seven frames of landing lag. I'm pretty sure. So yeah. it's not a lot. Um, so very tight timing, and it's really yeah. cool that Vivi managed to find it. And you know, you were saying how like, oh, you know, you kind of want to be at a higher percent than Lucario because then you can adva take advantage of the rage, but. Vivi's Lucario specifically, yeah. he's so good at getting these low percent combos, and then he's like, I can still kill you with forward smash. Mm -hmm. Forward smash is ridiculously strong, regardless of how much aura he has. Yeah, only had 50% aura there. So like not like a crazy amount, but that just killed, you know, not quite at, at center stage, but uh, about halfway to ledge. That was also, I felt like 80 percent excessive kill. As in like, that was not like, oh, you know, you, she almost survived. You died 10% no. ago. Yeah. Yeah. All right, did we get a color switch? We did get a color switch. Oh. I like this Lucario skin, the dark blue one. It's very cool. Ooh. That's... Oh, I see. Went dark blue to blend in with the background of the small battlefield. <laughs> very intelligent. Uh, I like it, though. And um, with that said, in thus far, uh, this is a huge log trap for the... You need to get your percent here uh, because... On the other hand, Dill is trapping Lucario. Not a position you want to be in. Ooh. Ooh, so much damage right there. And Vivi now 102%. Really kind of struggling. At the same Ooh. time, all oh right, I'm sorry. I, I, I Somehow I brain farted and forgot that, yes, this is in fact Vivi's Lucario. And right now, Dill is, is going to die. Yeah, and, and the thing, like, Aura Sphere is so good at the, the mid-percent range because it doesn't have quite enough knockback to really, like, scare you to die, but it forces you to jump. And, uh, yeah, Vivi knows invincibility there, so can't punish. Ooh, buff down tilt. That was so good. Just baited out that Roto Arm and punished You're beautifully. You're at 82%. Oh, <laughs> you <you're> die. <laughs> oh, how the mighty have fallen. Good. That was so you're, oh, quick. Oh, you're going to die. You're going to die again. You're going to die again. I, I'm not necessarily sure about that. I feel like this is the sort of thing where... You're going to die again. You got grabbed. It's over. That's it. <laughs> Game over. You died. You died. Lucario grab is like the only move that Lucario had you that died. doesn't just kill him. <laughs> you died. What I say? Roto arm it. Salty fun. What I say? What attack? Incredible stuff right there. Back air auto spacing really good for uh, for Vivi. Oh, sorry, for Dill rather. But I mean, at this point, there's so much that needs you to died. happen. Yeah. You died. What did I say, Salty fun? You died. Yeah, that's just a. Uh, that was things escalated. Just, like, out of that control. was one advantage state. That was like one advantage state, that last stock. And the, the second stock, it was like one combo. Yeah, that was like when, again, thank you so much, Vivi, for showing that off. Orsphere, Orsphere Bear. I mentioned it before. It's real, real good. Um, yeah, and after Dill took a huge... How many back airs got the kill? So uh, every stock. Every, every stock, stock was back air. That's yeah, this, this conversion was crazy. This uh, so into nice. the B reverse, and then, yeah, just call out the jump with the yeah. back air, and it killed. I So I remember once talking with Dill, and she said that one thing is that um, she doesn't like to get killed by the same thing twice. Yeah. Like, that's even if you're going to lose the match, that's, like, a goal. Yeah. You know, figure out why you died there, and then, at the very least, don't have that be, like, the same reason you died again. Yeah. That game, all three of those stocks were from the exact same death. So yeah, I think that... Similar situations, too. Not the... The, the last stock was a Aura Sphere, Aura Sphere, back air. That's a confirm ledge trap. 
But the two th stocks before that were just call outs on jumps or, yeah. la or landing. So, like, um, yeah, Vivi kind of had Dill's number. I think, again, um, after losing that game, too, uh, kind of a scary situation to be in against Lucario. Yeah. Uh, and then Vivi took full advantage. Yeah. Um, and kind of said, ah, you are spooked. 